many Windows 10 users are having trouble connecting to the internet and some are experiencing frequent connection problems. This issue occurs when you are connected to a network but have no internet connection or the signal keeps dropping. This difficulty might be caused by a defective ethernet cable, a modem problem, a service provider problem, a hardware problem, and so on. To fix this problem, you need to do a number of troubleshooting steps. Here are the things that you can try. Because the problem is with the internet, we recommend that you immediately check the ethernet connection to ensure that it is securely linked from the back of your PC to your modem. If it's loose, do a simple unplug. Plug technique to ensure it's well linked. Do the same with your modem. Remember that the ethernet wire from your modem to your PC is generally gray or blue in color. connection problem persists after inspecting the cable. Try inserting the ethernet cable into another port of your modem. A change of IP address may be able to remedy the issue. There is no solid rationale for this method. But most of the time when I have problems with my connection, I simply reinsert it into different ports and the problem is resolved. Hopefully, we have the same problem and it should be resolved when you execute it and reset your modem. Simply disconnect your modem's power cord and return it after 30 seconds to restart it. There are times when a security software will prevent you from accessing the internet, regardless of how much effort you put in. Whatever antivirus you have, we recommend temporarily disabling it and then re-enabling it if the problem persists. Another security software that you must check is the firewall. If your internet connection works normally when your Windows firewall is disabled, then you should consider updating your firewall to see if that will fix the issue. But first, you need to temporarily disable your firewall. Here's how. Click Start menu on taskbar. Type Windows Firewall on the search box. Click Turn Windows Firewall on or off. Put a bullet on Turn off Windows Firewall. Click OK to confirm. Go back to the desktop and try using the internet. various reasons. It may not immediately switch on the ethernet adapter after an update, preventing you from connecting to the internet. This is uncommon, but just in case, it's worth a shot to see whether it was activated. To test, perform the following steps. Right-click Start menu on the taskbar. Click Device Manager. Click Network Adapters drop-down arrow. Right-click the name of your network adapter. If the Enable option is present, click it to turn it on. Go back to desktop and see any progress. If the problem persists, you can try updating the driver. Typically, an out-of-date driver might create a problem or unstable connectivity. Replacing it can address this issue. Your PC Ethernet cable connection to your modem is okay but you still don't have internet. We recommend contacting your service provider. It makes no difference whatever provider you choose. If something is wrong with their service, you must notify them. There are times when they will disrupt your internet connection while updating or upgrading your system. And they almost always do so without warning. It is advisable to ask them directly. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like, subscribe to our channel, or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.